how's it going? This is Matt from snoozecentral.org and snoozetv.com. Today is always an awesome day. If you guys know what it is, today is snooze day. So I'm here actually with Lester. And uh, thanks again, guys, for all the feedback on his videos. Really appreciate it. So anyway, he's really curious and he wants to uh, take a look and see what my latest order is. I have it right down here. So let's, uh, let's take a look at it. Mm-hmm. All right, here's the latest order that I got from snoocentral.com. As always, fast shipping. Um, my case though, it was delayed by about a day. Uh, held up in customs. Typically that doesn't happen. Uh, they just know who I am and they're trying to put a stop to uh, snoocentv.com and the snooze revolution. So they're trying to hold up my reviews, but thankfully I got it here. It's in one piece, no damage, no missing cans. And I usually, you know, I never have a problem with shipping. Um, so guys, don't worry about it. It was just a uh, little fluke, a one-off type of thing. I think just because I got it sent to my work. But uh, anyway, let's take a look and see what I got here. Really excited for a lot of these snooses. Let's jump on in to the first ones, which is On Coffee and Berry. Uh, as you guys know, I've done the other flavors out of this line. And um, I liked them, so... Pretty excited to try these. Next up is a snooze I didn't review in about three years or so, which is Eton Original Portion. And I'm looking at doing a re-review on this guy. Very good stuff. I uh, can't wait to uh, do a re-review of this one. So three cans of that. Two of them are over here in this roll. Next up is a loose snooze. Yes, I do use loose. I'm not a huge fan of it just because it's a little messy. I prefer um, portion snooze a lot better, or a lot more. Um, but I figured I'd throw this in there to try it and see what my thoughts are. Next up is Jacobson's, from, uh, or Gotland snooze, Jacobson's Vin Bar, which is a blackberry snooze. And uh, yeah, again, I apologize for not taking the warning labels off. Um, I didn't have time yet. I just literally just opened this box and I wanted to share it with you guys. So, sorry for not taking the labels off. Um, but heard this one's pretty good. I got uh, two cans of that. Catch Licorice White Portion. Really good snooze. I just recently did a review on this one and was still craving it, so I threw in a couple more cans. Yay. Yeah. Yeah, Lester likes, yeah. Lester loves licorice. So, you might be taking a couple portions of that. Um, next up is Jotaborg's Rappé Lingenberry, which I thought they were going to be discontinuing, and uh, it's still on the market, so hopefully this sticks around for a little bit longer. I like this one quite a bit. Good for the summertime. This one, Scroof Red Ruby, which is a rhubarb flavor. I've heard mixed reviews on this one, uh, but I'll give you my full honest opinions on it. I love rhubarb, so hopefully this is going to be pretty good. All right, let's get on to the rolls. So this one um, is out of the new Scroof Nyans product, um, or Nyans, however you pronounce that. I'm just going to call them red, yellow, and blue. But I got five cans of the red, five cans of the yellow, and five of the blue, which is right here. I've heard great things about these offerings, and these are actually competing with the X-Range uh, line of products from Swedish Match. So, uh, yeah, they sound really, really good, and I cannot wait to tear into them. All right, there's my other Jacobson's um, Vinbar, or Blackberry. Two cans of Jacobson's Strong Cola, which is amazing. Two cans of Lift Tropic Breeze. Two cans of Lift Mellow, which is Berry Frost. And here's another Catch Licorice White. And I think I got three cans of this Knox Dark Portion. So I heard this tastes a lot like Grove, and uh, we'll see. As you guys know, I love Knox as a budget brand. Um, that's made by Scroof. And uh, we'll see how this one goes. I'm excited for this one, too. All right, next roll. There's the other Knox Dark. 
Um, four cans of the new Yotaborg's Rappé X Range uh, Anniversary Edition, which is uh, sparkling, which is supposed to taste like champagne. So we'll see how this one goes. I got four cans of it just because it's a special release. It's not going to be around for a while or for very long. And there's the five cans of the, again of these Skrufnayans, um, Halves Breeze, I believe. And uh, that's Skruf Blue. Pretty interesting. Again, there's the two other cans of the Eton. Now I got um, two cans of Crushed Ice from Nick and Johnny. Always a great mint flavor. Two cans of the Crushed Ice White. Two cans of Knox original portion. And uh, I'm going to be comparing this one to Knox Dark. And two more of the Yotaborg's Repay Lingon. Alright guys, so that was my order from snoocentral.com. Let me know down in the comment section below if you've tried any of these and what your thoughts are. As always, guy, as always guys, check the links down below. And don't forget to check out snoocentral.org. Thanks, and until next time, you know the drill. Enjoy good snooze. See you guys on the next one. Thanks for watching.